I'm Meredith and welcome to my channel. If you're new here, I'm so excited that you found me and if you're returning, I'm so grateful you've decided to come back and watch more. I love all things luxury. I love luxury shoes, I love luxury handbags, luxury lifestyle and vlogging and if they're things that appeal to you, I hope you'll do me a massive favour and hit that subscribe button down below. Today we have an Hermes unboxing. It's a new bag! <laughs> I'm so excited. It is not a quota bag. I'm sorry, it's not a quota bag, but it is a bag and it is brand new to Hermes. I think it's been out for about a month now, so it's not um, a bag that you will have seen a lot of because it just didn't exist. Um, and it comes in this box. <laughs> I'm so excited. I love it. I have seen it in store and tried it on and actually I really love this design. So there may be, this might be one that I am happy to have multiples of. So let's unbox it. Get it out of its box. So you have a little care card like you do with all Hermes um, bags. And we open it up. And we have the dust bag and it's upside down. <laughs> there we go. So in its little dust bag, it's all home there. And I do have to say, of all the luxury houses, Hermes really do the best with packaging their bags. There's lots of tissue paper, it's always really cushioned, and yeah, can't fault them for that ever. So we have our dust bag. It's not a very big bag. Oh, there we go. And this is the mini gypsy air in um ro mauve pale sorry mauve pale so it is like a pinky lilac color so if you know omez colors they have um rose sakura and they have um mauve sylvester this sits between those two so when you look at those three colors lined up this is like the baby of mauve uh, rose sakura and mauve sylvester so this, this is the one that sits in the middle so it is just this beautiful beautiful lilac color with pink undertones i love it and you probably get a better indication if you look at the strap as to exactly what color it is so it's just this beautiful cool cool tone um, and it has palladium hardware so you can see the palladium hardware there which still has the stickers on and they're coming off soon so it's just super cute um, my sales associate had told me that they were about to be released he asked me if I wanted one and I was like yeah I think I do I haven't had a gypsy air bag before I know they do bigger sizes um, but I thought this would be perfect perfect to travel with so I am going to um, London and Paris in late September um, and my fabulous friend Dale from Dale's Addiction um, this is actually her trip I'm hijacking it <laughs> um, and she will be there with me and part of going to Paris will be that I will try and get an appointment at Hermes so fingers crossed there let's see how I go but I really wanted to take an Hermes bag while I was traveling so that if I got an appointment I could take my bag with me to that appointment um, and I really don't want to take um, my Birkins or my Kellys because traveling with them is painful. Um, I'd be worried about them all the time and yeah, I just, I don't really want to travel with them. I want really easy bags. Um, so I thought this would be perfect to travel with. Now it is a light color. I appreciate that. Let's take that out. Um, I haven't taken all the stickers off, but I've certainly started. Oh, I can't cope. I just, I see a sticker and I want to peel it. Um, so it is a light color, so I will need to be careful because I plan to wear it cross body when this um, rubs up against me. So I will be very careful with like new jeans and that kind of stuff, but great bag. So if we open it up, it is um, like a cream color inside. It's one compartment and then it has a slip pocket there and that is it. It is super simple. So yes, it has the same closure that we see on all Birkins and Kellys where you've got to put the 
um, toggles through um, which can make it cumbersome but it also makes it really secure so I am reading nothing but horror stories about um, people having their bags snatched and pickpockets in Europe and I'm like oh my goodness because in Australia yes we have those things but um, it's really not prevalent. I feel really safe in Australia all the time. I never worry about anything like that. And having read all these horror stories, I'm like, oh my God, I'm gonna be pickpocketed. But I really like the fact that in this one case, getting into the bag is hard because I'm less likely to be pickpocketed if that um, if they find it hard to get in. So I haven't done that up wrong. Right, sorry, let me put it in its little home so you can see what it actually looks like. There we go, that's better. Okay, so yes, so you have the, um, bits on either side so this is how this is impossible to get into unless you are tr like you are actually turning the lock yourself so I think it's going to be a really secure bag for that reason I have it set on the longest setting because this is how I tried it on in store and it goes cross body it sits right at my hip it is perfect absolutely perfect I am five foot four, so it is perfect for me. And I am very aware of the fact that it is on the longest possible setting and is perfect for me at five foot four. So if you are taller than 160 centimeters or five foot four, it probably isn't going to cross body the same way it does on me. If you are shorter than me, you'll probably have it sit just below your hip bone, um, which is fine for cross -bodying. But yes, if you are tall, please take this in consideration that it is perfect for me, who is five foot four. Um, and I love it. I love the color. I love the style. I actually really, really love this. So I'm super happy to have it. Now, I've grabbed a few things so you can see what fits in this in case anyone else is interested. So let's open it up. So I have a Calvi card holder, which is quite thick. Um, and the size of any card holder really and a six ring key ring holder six ring key holder my phone oh, is down here so I have a 14 pro not a max just a pro and look I can easy get a lipstick and my passport in there no worries at all it's a great size so let's do it up now that it's got things in it and you can see how it sits so I put the little toggles through. To If I'm wearing it around Australia, to be fair, I probably really won't do it up like my Birkins and my Kelly. Um, but in Europe, definitely I will be doing it up. So that's got things in it now and it is perfect. So I think this is a fantastic size of the Gypsy Air. The bigger ones have never really spoken to me, but I really love this mini. And like I said, this is in mauve pale if anyone is interested in the color but it's just such a pretty pretty color i know that they've done it clearly in lots of different colors um and yeah it would be really handy in a black i feel but then i gravitate towards black backs all the time um and yeah it, it would actually be a great um everyday bag if you don't mind this closure on it. If the closure is going to drive you nuts, then clearly it's not a great everyday bag. Like I said, I see it as a really, really secure travel bag, which is what I'm going to be using it for. And it is a little less in your face branded than some of my other bags that I usually travel with, which is also a consideration while I'm going to be in Europe. Um, I want to um, be a bit more if you know you know rather than hey look it's Louis Vuitton and um, every other major fashion house just because I'm trying not to draw too much attention to myself um, I really don't want to be robbed I'm a little scared about that but it'll be fine um, so yes this is my brand new mini gypsy air from Hermes and I love it so if you're interested they're out now they've been out for about a month now if you've liked today's video, please give it a thumbs up and hit that subscribe button down below. It means a lot to a content creator when you hit that subscribe button. Please also hit the little bell notification so you know when I've uploaded videos, which is usually three times a week. I'll also throw up my Instagram handle for you so you can come follow me over there. I put lots up in real time, lots around my day-to-day -day life and my collection, so please come follow me over there. I hope wherever you are in the world today, you are having a fabulous day, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye, guys.